My name is Autumn Wintersgill from Knitting in the Red, and today we're going to talk about a vertical loop crochet. The vertical loops in crochet are found in a technique called Tunisian crochet. This is a crochet technique that is very similar to knitting in that you're working across the row, picking up stitches, and then doing a return pass, working back through those same stitches. When you are working, your first pass of Tunisian crochet, you will be going through the vertical loop or vertical bar of the previous row. I'm now going to insert my hook under the vertical bar of the first stitch. Here it is. Please note that you are going to go into the second vertical bar from the end of your row. So I'm going into this vertical bar. After you insert the hook into the vertical bar, you are going to yarn over and pull up one loop. Go into the next vertical bar of your row, yarn over and pull up one loop. You will repeat this process across the row to create your first Tunisian crochet row. When you reach the end of this row, you will go through the second to last vertical bar and then the edge of this row to ensure that you don't lose stitches. When you are ready to work through these vertical loops on your hook, you're going to yarn over and pull through two loops then yarn over and pull through the loop on your hook and the next loop. Repeat this process across the row. After you are done, you will be able to see the vertical loops that exist from the row that you just made. Again, my name is Autumn Wintersgill from Knitting in the Red, and you just learned about the vertical loop in crochet.